What's up team, Starless there here, back with another video, so we're going to be working on the castle today. I'm going to try to start the arch, and then another tower, and then go look into finishing the tower. So, stay tuned for that, I'm going to do a little work on the arch, gather a little supplies, but we'll be back in a minute. Uh, just to update you though on what's going on with our pillagers, that we so successfully trapped, we actually, it's weird, like, this guy stayed, the, uh, the, I think he's called the, like, the raid leader, um, but all the other ones despawned, and they ended up right, two of them ended up right there, and, uh, this is weird, they're, oh, a sapling from that? Dope. They're not moving, but they're there, so, uh, yeah, more to follow on that, but, yeah, so we're just gonna get working. Oh, and also, this guy showed up. A little while ago um, he disappears so if you've never seen one of these guys he's like a traveling merchant um, he doesn't really have anything that cool to sell except for these acacia saplings I, I say hey, how are you I don't know I don't freaking know anyways I thought about buying from him but um, I'm probably gonna save my emeralds for someone else but they just look so dope and I wish I could like capture this llama thing but I think it's broken but he's like tethered to this guy so I basically can't I can't even, like, rope him off. Like, when he despawns, he'll despawn, so. Big bummer. As far as the other villagers go that I let out and hoped would, like, find jobs. Yeah, well, they're, like, the rest of, you know, liberal America and are just waiting for something to come to them, I guess. Because they won't freaking find work. And I guess I gotta let these guys out, too. I don't know. I think they actually ended up back in there. I've still only got this one guy, so. I don't know. We'll see if we can get them some jobs, but, uh, we'll see. Oh my gosh, look at this! Look at the llama! <laughs> what? I was literally just, like, walking back from, uh, chopping down some wood, and <laughs> look at the freaking llama! How did that happen? Yo, that's wild! And that's really weird. I... The Enderman. That's crazy! Is the guy, like, in here? What's he? What, how did he get up there? That's sick. I hope he freaking stays. Also, oh, look at that. I didn't even know we had this guy. Okay, so this guy might have gotten a job. He might be new. But anyways, that was awesome. I think he's gone already, though. Or is he just on the other side? Yo, that's sick. All right, I'll keep you guys updated. I hope he stays. All right, so I'm thinking for the arch, we're going to do, like, the same eight wide uh, width and then another tower and I want it to go up like two I think so let me get some blocks ready and then we'll come back all right so I know that I want I, I want <laughs> there was a point to that uh, I don't have any dirt sick uh, that's my, like, scaffolding. I know that I basically want, um, the walkway itself to be stone. Okay? So. Ignore, ignore my horrible scaffolding. So if that's one. Then this will be two. Up, do this. I think that's too much. <laughs> I think that's too much. So that was that. So now we go like this. So it was one, two. So one, one, I can't count. One, two, three, four. So now I do the same thing on the opposite side. Let's look at how horrible this looks. That's not right. <laughs> Can I make it look better? It looks a little bit better. Uh, what if I did it like... Um, dang it. <laughs> not going well. That's not what I wanted to do. What? <laughs> Stop. That's definitely not right. Alright. 
I'll be back. All right, so I think going for something like this, I'm going to try to kind of outline it in wood and see how that goes. I still want to be able to see some of the stone. So be right back with that. Are you kidding me? I don't know how that happened. They just showed up. Like, I literally was building, turn around to go to sleep at night, and they're just sitting there. <laughs> but, like, they don't attack you unless you look at them and you're, like, within three steps. So, oh, no, now there's zombies. All right. So I need to get rid of these zombies and go to sleep. And then handle the pillagers. Oh, my gosh, I don't have any beds here. Sick. Nothing is going well. <laughs> Nothing is going well at all. I think I have a bed at the bottom of this mine shaft. I got too sucked up into building. Let it get too late. Turn around, there's pillagers. Oh man, I hope. Can zombies still convert villagers to uh, zombie villagers? This is about to be very unfortunate. Alright, so we need to go out and see if uh, there are any zombie villagers, if there are any zombies. And then I guess we gotta bury our friggin' raiders again, the pillagers. I don't know why they despawned last time, but they need to not. Oh, there's a creeper. Don't want him. Okay, that villager's okay. That villager's okay. Okay, I think the zombies have died. Alright, going to deal with the pillagers now. Alright, there's a zomb. Did they follow me? That's a skeleton. That's who shot at me. I think the pillagers despawned when I ran away. What about this guy? What about the raid captain? Shoot, he's gone too. Oh, brother. Alright. Keep you updated. Alright, guys. So I think this is what I'm going with for the arch. Um, and then I'll build this second tower right alongside of it here. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm basically just going to model this one on this side there. And get it started. And then I'll come back to you when I've got both towers made. Alright, so I've done a good bit here. I've got the arch completed and then started on the second tower. I'm a little concerned that the arch is like too small for the scale of the towers. Um, especially if I kept going up with the towers. So I think my solution is going to be where they're at right now. I'm going to start going, I'm going to start like another pillar within the tower to go up that's smaller. So it's like basically a big cylinder on the base and then a smaller cylinder going up higher. You'll see what I mean when I start it, um, and I think that'll help a lot, and then I'll cap it off with, like, a turret, and a turret is kind of like what we've got here, um, just in a circle instead of, like, a roof, like a triangular roof. We'll just have, like, a circular turret, so you'll see what I'm saying, but I'm going to go ahead and finish the second tower base, and we'll see where we're at. All right, guys, so I've completed, like, the, the uh, half of the second tower. Um, as you can see, still got the, the back half there and waiting to be done, but I really do like the way it's looking, but this is going to be a big project. Like these are some pretty thick towers and, um, I'm not really sure where to go from here. Like I said, I'm going to do the thinner rest of the tower up top and then I'm going to go out with it. I know with some walls. So uh, I think that's all we're going to do for today. I'm probably going to finish up the outside of that tower on my own when I just kind of log on to play, but yeah, that's what's going on with the tower. So I, let me know what you think about it and how it's coming. If you have any suggestions, let me know. Let me know what you think about going thinner up here so it's not as thick and like, uh, I just think it would be too much. So let me know. We're going to go check on that llama out uh, at the village. We're going to check on some of the villagers and uh, yeah, I'll see you there. All right, so we're back in the village. I've determined that I'm going to let all these guys run. So they need to get out of here. I don't really care if the cows get out. Okay, I'm trying to jump over the fence. That's not how that works. I'm gonna try to push them out of here. Oh, look, that that guy just he that guy just changed. He guy definitely just changed. I can't speak right now. Okay, you wanna stay in here, buddy? So that's how they're getting in on their own, is by that, and I know that, so I'm gonna try to get, there's two of them in there, so I'm trying to get those around, okay, where did the guy go that had the, like, purple vest on, yo, he probably went back in there and then changed, is that what happened, come on, out of here, Stop out. 
All right, so nothing there, nothing on these guys. I don't know where the purple guy went. It looked really cool. Hopefully, we can see him again. I feel like he took, like, the vest off. Like, those guys are chatting. Okay, let's go check on the llama. He's still up there. All right, so that's definitely a glitch, and it might fix next time I log out and log back in. Uh, I'll be sure to let you guys know. But, uh, yeah, so that's what's going on with the village. Trying to get those guys some jobs. I think I'm going to put in, like, the uh, blacksmithing tool. Uh, there's a new one, so it's not the anvil anymore, but I'm going to put that thing in and see if it affects anything. I know we just got, like, a cleric or a priest or whatever they're called, but then he, he ditched unless he's... Oh, he's right there. There he is. There he is. Let's check him and see if he's got me. Dope. So I need rotten flesh, which is huge. Or emeralds. Okay, so good. Yeah, yeah. So he changed because there's the little chemistry set in there. So if I put the uh, anvil down, that should fix things. All right, guys. Well, that's it for this episode. So like I said, let me know what you think of the project so far. If you've got any suggestions or anything on the village, you can see the little llama back there. And that's how I actually saw him. I'm going to collect some saplings before they all despawn. I think they might have. And I might have ruined that. But, uh... Yeah. Okay, I'll catch you guys later. Thanks for watching, guys. This has been Stella Star. Like, subscribe, more content.